I literally saw my life flash in front of me. And Times Square clash, new information on the car that drove into protesters. And new tonight, the passenger in that car talks with us. That's where we start on this Friday night. I'm Natalie Pascarello. The startling video you see here, it's going to show that car plowing through right there. The Black Lives Matter protesters in Times Square. Police say the people in the car were counter protesters who sparred with the demonstrators earlier. And we have exclusive video of that car, which News 4 found today. Reporter Mark Santia and his this photographer saw it driving around this morning. You're going to see what happens next when we ask the driver to speak with us. And new at six, we're hearing from a woman who was in that car. I want to get right out to Mark, who's in Times Square with this new information, Mark. And Natalie, police say they specifically asked the counter protesters inside that Ford Taurus to turn here through the Marriott, go through the taxi well, but instead the counter protesters kept driving. They were stopped here at the light on Broadway. That's when police say they were surrounded by protesters who hit the window and that Taurus took off. Sir, can we talk to you about what happened last night? Windows up, nothing to say. We spotted the same black Ford Taurus that plowed through a group of protesters last night, rolling along 42nd Street today. Josh Wood was one of those protesters. He was on his bike. Uh, as soon as the car stopped, it tried to keep moving again. Um, it rammed into my bike once. I took a step back. It rammed me again. At this point, it was pretty clear that there was nothing I was I could do. This car wants to run through this crowd anyway. Hundreds of people were protesting the death of Daniel Prude, who died in police custody in Rochester. Police tell us five counter protesters were inside the Taurus, including Juliet Germanata. Uh, the protesters got in 46th Street, blocked us in, started trying to open the car, hitting the car. The driver then drove through to try to get us to safety. Germanata posting last night on her Instagram page just as the protest got underway. There's supposed to be a group of peaceful protesters coming out here. Germanata has previously clashed with Black Lives Matter protesters. She was taken into custody multiple times for dumping paint on the mural outside Trump Tower. Can we do an interview with you, sir, about what happened last night in Times Square? Back to this Ford Taurus, the same one from the Times Square incident, the driver declining to talk with us. We pulled over, they drove off. Law enforcement sources tell News 4 detectives have now interviewed every person who is inside the Ford Taurus, and they tell us the investigation is ongoing. We're live in Times Square. I'm Mark Santia, News 4 New York.